video. So today's video I'm kind of excited about. Kind of. So today we're going to be doing a bridal makeup look. I absolutely love bridal makeup looks, so I just kind of wanted to kind of create my own. If you want to see how I create this look, then keep on watching. And I'm going to start by mixing two products together. I'm going to mix the Jaffra Sun Tinted Face Sunscreen and my e.l.f. Power Grip Face Primer. I'm just going to mix it on the back of my hand. I'm going to put a small amount of the primer. And I'm just going to use the back of a brush just to mix it all together. And then I'm going to use the Bedelia Muscle Brush to apply this. I'm going to let that kind of soak in. I'm going to now do my brows. Since this is a bridal makeup look, I want to do my eyes first. And I always start with my eyebrows when I do my eyes. So I'm going to take my Brown Leaving Deal from J-Cat in Sand. And we are going to start with the clear shade first. Or not clear shade. I'm going to start with the lighter shade. I'm going to take the lighter shade and I'm going to start applying it in the inner part of the brow. Okay, and then towards the end of the brow, I'm going to use the darker shade. I also mentioned this in one of my other videos. So this lip liner is kind of too dark for what I like on my lips. So I thought it would be perfect to use this as a um, eyeliner or like a brow pencil. So I'm going to use it as a brow pencil today. So I'm just going to take an extra step and kind of um, create brow hairs in the brows where there's like kind of sparse areas. I'm going to set the brows with my NYX HD Finishing Powder and then later we're going to also use a brow brush. I'm just going to the brows to kind of also soften them a little bit because they they went a little crazy. Now I'm going to burn out the eyebrows. I already did my left eyebrow, but I'm going to do the other one right now. So I'm just going to take my what is this? The J Cat Masterclass Face Palette. This is the light to medium palette. I'm going to take this shade here. I'm just going to go around. The brow. I've never carved out my brow before, so I don't know how it's going to look. Take my where was it? my Jaffra Beauty Blender and just blend the concealer or the foundation in. And that made it look a lot better, I think. I like the way that that looks. And we can touch it up later at the end of the makeup. So now we can move on to the eyes. So I already primed my eyes with, actually, yeah, with the um, sunscreen and the, um, the primer. So I'm going to go ahead and apply some concealer on the lids just to cancel out any discoloration. I'm also, uh, where, what brush did I just use? Oh, right here. I'm going to use the same color that we used to carve out the brows. I'm going to take this and just apply this to the entire lid. I 
also set it with my HD, with my NYX HD finishing powder. I'm gonna use a fluffy brush. This one is from BK Beauty, I think. Okay, so I was looking through my um, eyeshadow palette collection and I was thinking like what's one palette that I can use for like everyday special occasions and stuff like that so I came across this palette I, I love that this palette so much this is one of my favorite ones um, the Jaclyn Hill and Morphe palette so first I'm going to take actually me get another we're actually going to use two eyeshadow palettes today. I totally forgot about this one. So we're going to use the Flower Beauty um, Petal Play Eyeshadow Quad. This one is in Gilded Lily. I'm going to start with the color Fawn. It's a really, really nice trans trans transition shade that I absolutely love. I'm going to use the e.l.f. crease brush to apply this. We are going to start by applying this in the crease. And then we're going to take a deeper shade and we're going to apply that in the outer part of the eye. Okay, we're going to go with in the, in the Jaclyn Hill palette, we're going to go in with 24-7. And take a tiny bit of this, tap off the excess. Like I said, we're going to place this in the outer part of the eye, kind of like. Um, up, to, up in the crease as well. Okay, now we're going to take the color Obsessed. I'm going to take this with my finger. And we're going to apply this on the lid. I'm also going to go back in to 24-7 and darken that area up a little bit more. Now I'm going to just take a, a makeup wipe just to wipe away any fallout and kind of clean up the corners as well. Okay, now we're going to go into the face. So we already applied um, Um, primer earlier with the sunscreen so I'm gonna go straight into foundation now I want a full coverage foundation so I'm gonna use the the ordinary coverage foundation this one is in light medium I'm going to use my Jaffra Beauty Blender to apply it Now I'm going to go into concealer. I'm going to use the e.l.f. Hydrating Camo Concealer. And the only spots we're going to apply this are under the eye. I think, yeah, that's the only place. And then we're going to use the J. Crap Master Pot um, Glass Face Palette again. And we're going to use this shade. I'm going to try to, now I'm going to apply this to any blemishes that pop through. Even though this is still a full coverage foundation, I want to just do an extra step. Spray the, the concealer as well before we go in with the beauty blender and blend it. To set the concealer, I'm going to use the same 
um, powder, the, the NYX HD Finishing Powder, and then we're going to take the Lisa V Angled Concealer Brush to set the concealer. Go in with my Jaffra 2-in-1 um, powder makeup. This is in cream. I'm going to take my Real Techniques powder brush to apply this. We're going to set the rest of the face. I'm also going to set down the neck. Now we're going to go into blush. I'm going to use the uh, Jaffra um, powder blush in Rose Oral. I'm going to apply this on my cheek. And no, not Casey. These are the Kiss Look, look So Natural Lashes. Okay, for lips, I'm going to use the Jaffa Royal Jelly Lip Liner in Diana. First, I'm going to wipe off any foundation that got on the lips. Go into my lip liner, and I'm, especially this color, I'm going to just use my finger to do that. And for a lipstick, I'm going to use the Jaffa Luxury Lipstick in the Chiffon. I'm going to just run the powder through the brows. Again, just in where we applied the lip liner. And I'm going to take my Jaffra Clear Brow Gel to set the brow. Bring my DIY finishing spray. Okay, now it's time for the Bible verse of the day. This one is Psalm 23, 1 and 2. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. Well, that was it for today's video. See you again in the next one. Bye!